to use the analyzer as a pressure meter, first move the rotary switch to pressure. You notice that the pump stops. At this stage, don't have any hose connected to the pressure meter. Press the pump button to zero the pressure meter. Now you notice on the display it has pressure to two decimal places, reading in millibars, and you have a clock so you can actually manually time a test if you wanted to. What we're going to do is actually set a burner pressure as per the manufacturer's instructions. So we've zeroed the pressure sensor. I can now connect the hose to P1. It's already connected to uh, the boiler. Now I can fire the boiler. Just wait for the pressure to stabilize. So here we've got a pressure of 7.3 millibars. On this particular boiler, the manufacturer's instructions say set the burner pressure to 6.9 millibars. To do this, you adjust the regulator screw anti-clockwise to 6.9 millibars.